Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another video here in Passy Just Skin. It's absolutely a pleasure to have you. Thank you very much for joining us. Today, we're going to look at something a little bit different. Obviously, things that we can do on the PlayStation on Sony's wonderful device of entertainment just keep expanding, man. They just keep expanding. And I was browsing around the stuff on the actual PlayStation Store. If you actually, let's see if I can get you the. the nope, wrong one. Wrong one. Okay, hang on. Let me see here. I'm trying to find the right screen for this. Hmm, nope, 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 that's not working, so I might as well just switch this over, so all I'm going to do is hit that, boom! Right, so as I was browsing through the PlayStation Hong Kong screens in the actual PlayStation Store, I realized and I noticed something here right in the middle. Now, it's a little bit hard to see, maybe a little bit actually under res but you can see where it says Persona 3, the movie, Spring of Birth. Now, there's a Persona 3 live anime movie uh, called Spring of Birth, if you didn't already know about it, it's actually existent. I showed you a nice little screen of it there a second ago, but it's now going to be available to watch in the Theatre Room VR, which is a uh, new Theatre Room kind of like cinema mode for those PSVR users. So what we're going to do is actually try and sign up for it right now. Uh, if you want to sign up for it yourself, the address is at the top of the screen. You can actually send you find it right across there. Asia.playstation.com forward slash THT dash HK forward slash forms forward slash PS and forward slash PS VR dash theater dash room dash uh, VR dash <laughs> person three dash survey. This is actually the survey that they're actually talking about that you need to fill in to get a chance of taking part in this. Now to take part in this, you need to have a Asian PSN account, specifically a Hong Kong account. I'm pretty sure there's a version of this for the Japan and for the other countries uh, that are involved in this. But specifically, this is the Hong Kong one. So if you want to do this, you want to see any of this, you have to actually be signed in to your Hong Kong account, as I am right here. So going down to the questions, uh, I have actually translated this page into English. It is in Chinese normally, but uh, obviously there's a, a few simple ones here that are a little bit mistranslated along the way, but you can understand the questions easy enough. Have you used the Theater Room VR application? Yes, I have. I have actually been playing out a bunch of beta tests with VR modes on the PS4. Actually, in fact, I think the most recent one I tried was a UEFA Cup Championship match watched in VR from like the manager's booth or from the owner's booth, which was really interesting to watch. I just wish it wasn't sport. Uh, what kind of video content do you like? I chose TV series. Anything but sports. What type of features and content would you like the Theater Room VR to add? That's pretty much my answer. And of course, provide your PSN ID. Also, you can get a hold of me on this address because it is also on the website. Uh, did he, did he, what am I missing? Boop, 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 boop. Oh yes, I have to I submit the form. Boom! That is it. That's all you have to do. Answer those four questions, submit, and hope for the best. Let's see, translate this in English, see if there's anything important to be said. Form has been successfully submitted. Your submission is complete. My submission is total. I am giving up myself. Thanks for supporting PlayStation Plus. You have successfully participated in PS Plus Theater Room VR by priority registration activity. Redemption code will be sent by SMS on August 7th. Redemption code is valid until August 14th. So we're going to get to do a beta test with this if we do get selected. I hope so because I've actually applied in for it as quickly as I saw it happening. But this is a limited experience. You can only a few people get into it at a time. So I highly recommend you check it out as soon as you can. Because otherwise you're going to miss out. That's a little bit of information from me here on Seat of Skin. I'm going to be back. I'm always broadcasting on stream on a regular enough basis. If you want to get a hold of me or you want to see the shows, always check us out on stream. It's always going to be on from um, two to three days of the week. I'll be on for a couple of hours. But the show, the videos, the channel, we are going to continue on. We have a lot of stuff back in archive. I just haven't been broadcasting as much to actually record shows individually. I want to say thank you very much for everybody who's stuck around, who's actually been enjoying the content. There's over a thousand videos on this channel. If you have gotten bored and ran out of things to watch in this channel, you are a liar. I can see it in the analytics. So go and find something here on the channel you can check out. There's plenty of stuff to see. I've covered a lot of games in the last two to three years. So if you want to actually check out some of those, make sure to do so in the videos and the links around the screen, wherever they may be. <coughs> I'm dying. I'm dying. <coughs> Ow. Okay, so I'm just going to go here. Uh, thank you very much for watching. I hope to actually entertain you all again very soon. Make sure to check out more stuff here on the channel. And I will see all you dudes in the next video. Bye.